guys welcome to my channel today I'm just going to be giving you a really quick tutorial on something I've been loving this summer it's just a really quick and easy way to add a little bit of color to your face and just add that quick little pop to make you feel all springy and happy for the sunshine so let's just hop right into it so Today the one product I'm going to be using is my little favorite find, this Revlon Lip Butter. Now, wow, I freaking love this. It's so moisturizing, it hydrates my lips like crazy and just leaves them so soft and smooth. And usually lip colors do the opposite unfortunately. But this isn't just a lipstick. Like I said, it's a lip butter. All nice and buttery and smooth. And these are great. Come on, you little stink. Ah, there we go. These are fabulous because it's in between um, a tinted like lip balm and a lipstick. I would say it gives more coverage and color than just your average tinted lip balm. I'll show you a little swatch of how awesome this is. This color is tutti frutti. You can see that, I don't know, it's kind of hard to tell. But it's just this fabulous little coral color and who doesn't want some tutti frutti on their lips? I do, <laughs> I want it. So anyways, I'm just gonna use this real quick. On my lips. And it's really easy, no fuss. You just put it on super fast. Rub your lips together. Um, Revlon lip butters, there's about 20 different colors. So if you're not a coral girl, um, they have the cutest pinks. Oh my gosh, they're adorable. Uh, they have like plum colors and nude colors. Anyways, now what I'm going to do and this is where my little tippy tricky comes in. I use this lip butter as like a little, um, kind of like a cream blush for my cheeks. So I'm just going to use a little bit on my finger. And seriously, just dab it on the apples and rub it in with my fingers. And if you are someone who loves um, brushes, you can do that too. So... See, just a little bit. Look how cute, putting it on my little apples. You want to blend it back so you don't have like little uh, baby doll circles on your cheeks because that's not super cute. And there, see how that gives you just like the nicest little natural rosy glow. I've been doing this when I go to the beach or if I just don't really want to wear a ton of blush on my cheeks or you know sometimes you're just in a hurry and you need to run out the door and you don't have a lot of time and you just want to grab that one product that will help you look a little bit more perky uh, so yeah I absolutely love these you should totally give this a try um, you don't have to even though I've been using this for more of like the spring and summer type of looks, I think this can totally go into fall as well. Um, like I said, they have more of like the plums and browns and nudes. You could totally use one of those and use this tip for that. So I hope you enjoyed this and I hope some of you try this out. Let me know in the comments below if this is something you um, liked. And also, I should probably warn you, I don't have sensitive skin. So if you're someone who has sensitive skin or tends to break out easier, a little bit of warning. Don't get mad at me if you break out because I'm warning you. Got it. Warning you. So anyways, try it out. Let me know if there's any other looks or any questions you have for me. Totally let me know in the comments below. And I will get back to you. Thanks, guys. Have a fabulous day. Bye.